We're here with Gary from Century Chimney, and obviously you guys do inspections. That's a big part of what you do, as well as clean chimneys. But what exactly does an inspection show me? Like, as a, as a chimney owner, a homeowner, what what kind of things can you point out to me? Sure. So there are two parts of our inspection, interior and exterior. Let's just break it down to those okay. two simple things, if we will, for a moment. So the interior is we're looking at the, the firebox to make sure that everything's in good shape there. There's an area right above the smoke chamber that, uh, or right above where we build a fire in the firebox, right behind the damper that's called the smoke chamber. Okay. And that tapers into the flue tile in most brick and mortar chimneys. Right. Now there are what are called prefabricated chimneys as well. They are sided on the outside. They have a stainless steel liner, a little bit different, but fairly similar in, in many different ways. So we are looking at the interior of the chimney with a camera. And we run uh, a, 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 a tank strong camera, one that just, you know, it still breaks every once in a while. We got to send it in for repairs, <laughs> but that spins around and pans and tilts and we can see everything inside of a chimney that some chimney companies can't because they don't invest in this. Okay. And that's the most important part of this job, I think, is, you know, it's the cleaning and the inspection. So sometimes people will miss a hole or a crack or that type of thing that we can see. So that's um, nice. And that reveals that's something obviously and that you can't just see that kind of stuff sometimes with a, a flashlight looking up, right? You cannot. Yeah, I, so, I, I tried that myself. Maybe yeah. you have too. And it's you can only see so much. Right. And it's yeah. a big safety concern. So yeah. then on the outside, we're looking at the um, weathering and the deterioration. So if there's any mortar missing, if the concrete crown that sheds water to the sides is missing, okay. if there's not the right type of liner for a heating appliance, it could even be your furnace and your hot water heater that's causing moisture inside the chimney, that type of thing. Any of these things, any any and all of these things we're looking at, and I wish I had more time to tell you every single thing well, that we looked at, because we look at so many different things when we're looking at a chimney. Yeah. Well, well, you know, Gary has mentioned quite a few things right here. And uh, if you want to find out a little more, head to the mm -hmm. website. We have a lot of videos like this and we've covered, mm -hmm. you know, what does it mean when there's a crack inside your chimney? We've mm -hmm. covered, you know, about getting flashing. You can see videos on that at the website at centurychimney.com. So check it out. And if you like what you see and you're feeling good, give these guys a call. And mm -hmm. Gary, you and your crew would love to come out. Yeah, absolutely. All right. Hey, thanks a lot for watching.